because literally this shit could be with another dude right now. Literally. Real shit. And and in and, and, and 2021, it'd be like that, yo. She could be with a whole nother dude right now. And in case your ears are get the fuck out. Saying. So if I see her at school, shut it. Ignore her. And go about your day. That's it, man. That's it. You already, I already answered that question already. Go, go about your goddamn day. That's what you do. That's what you do. I've done it before and shit. I've done that in recent years. There's some chick that I was like, okay, you know, so it's good. And she got a boyfriend or she ain't with it. I just never talk to her again. They get mad, but who cares? Cause they're not helping me make any money. They don't pay my bills. They don't. They don't do anything. She's not doing me any favors. And what can she do anyway? Help me spend money and waste my time? Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, especially like right now. It's not me. You're choosing yourself. Who is she? Because this is what I'm saying. She she wouldn't, like, if she had to be mean to you, she wouldn't think twice about me being mean to you. However way she's got to be mean to you. So don't worry about being mean to people who aren't worried about being mean to you. Straight up. Straight up. That's a fact. Because there's no there's no law that that you have to be nice to somebody who's not being nice to you. She didn't say hey to me last time when we were in study hall. She No, then fuck that yo. She don't exist anymore, bro. She don't she don't exist. Is she not saying she is she not even saying what up? Like, oh hey, you know what I'm saying, what's going on? Don't even talk to her. You have to learn from this. Like don't let those times go in vain because then it's gonna happen over and over and over again. It's like in life, if you go through some shit and you don't learn from it, it's going to happen again and again and again until you get it. You know what I'm saying? It, it's just, this is the reality of life. Like right now, that same girl you're talking about, I can go on Instagram and find 50 girls that look just like her. So that just goes to show you she's nothing special. She's nothing special. The young dog, like a lot of them aren't even. Exactly. exactly. You get with a lot of these girls, they wouldn't even know how to treat you anyway. They don't know how to treat niggas you get in a relationship with them. They wouldn't know what to do with you if you got in a relationship with them. Real shit. Like relationships, especially like once you get to a certain age, is literally about like what you're building. And you can't build anything with a chick that's not even ready. Cause to me, in like life now, I look at I look at women the same way I look at all these bad guys in here. Like they're just a dime a dozen. Not even worth my time. <laughs> not even worth my time. And that's how you gotta look at them, bro. Cause you start to put them on pedestals and stuff, that's when they take advantage of you, bro. Real shit. And the thing is, and you guys actually have the benefit of social media where people kind of, it's like um, relationships is a topic of discussion now and you just see it all the time on the internet. So you guys have a lot of resources at your fingertips. When I was coming up, there weren't, <laughs> like there was, there used to be no Instagram, bro. And no relationship videos either. Like you either knew or you didn't know. Yeah, I heard that she texts her other friends and she's... Yeah! You can't prioritize somebody that's not prioritizing you, bro. Don't do it. Because if you're not important to her, she ain't important to you. Literally, all my friends ask me why I haven't got a girlfriend yet. And it's because a lot of girls my age don't care about relationships like the way I do. And I feel like a lot of them start maturing right... See, women don't even mature... Women don't even mature in their... Um, they don't even mature in their 20s. You know what I'm saying? Women mature in their in their late twenties, maybe thirties. It depends on the kind of lifestyle that they lived while they were in high school and in their early twenties. So, meaning, if you have a chick that dated a lot of guys and was around in school, then she's gonna mature in her in her early to mid twenties. Why? Because she had her fun already. You know what I'm saying? But if you if you're dealing with a chick that hasn't had her fun and she hasn't like, you know smutted herself out and you know had whole moments and stuff like that she's gonna treat you like dirt she's gonna treat you like dirt in 2021 and onwards she will treat you like dirt women aren't trying to fall in love anymore bro those are all out and about and the best thing you can do is mess around with the girls that want to mess around with you and it's easy or focus on yourself which i would advise focusing on yourself because let me tell you like the reason why like i i like love dancing so much is because dancing will always be there you know what i'm saying like myself and my love of dancing my love of acting and the craft will always be there so i don't have to worry about none of that you know what i'm saying but a girl she can just yo here's some real quote it was like the woman that you love can wake up and decide to love somebody else the next day but a dollar bill a hundred dollar bill will always be a hundred dollar bill never forget that yo a dollar bill will always be a dollar bill and meaning 
girls would just be fucking around with mad different guys and shit all around and stuff like that. That means a girl that you think is special can just be easily obtained like an item by the next guy. So why would you allow a woman like that to hurt you, son? Real shit. Real shit. And I'm saying this to you guys, but even at, even at my age right now, I still have to keep that in mind, yo. Because it's easy to get lost. True, I'm not going to let this girl rule my... Yeah, yeah, yo, don't, don't do that, bro. Because she's not gonna let you. She's not. She's not gonna um let you ruin hers. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Cause right. Cause literally, she could be with another dude right now. Literally, real shit. And in 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 2021, it'd be like that, yo. She could be with a whole another dude right now. She's not here, right? She could be at home, laid up with another dude on the phone with another guy, sending pics to another guy. So what am I gonna do? Let that ruin my day? Nah, nah. Better myself. Go to the dance studio, dance, edit some videos, you know what I'm saying? Work on a script. Stay busy, yo. Just like you said, yo, she be busy, get busy, bro. Get busy. That's the best thing you can do in this life. Because women, they can just disappear tomorrow. Yo. <laughs> women are, are, are like modern-day magicians and shit. Just disappearing acts, yo. Just disappearing. Just disappearing. Because you, you have to find that. You have to, you have to find things that that you can put yourself into. It's like, it's like, um, it's like you're... You're, you're like a cup and you, ju you just fill that cup with stuff that you love to do stuff that makes you feel good stuff that makes you a better person a better man you know what I'm saying thank me later <laughs> thank me later cuz you'll remember this if you if you literally just apply everything I'm saying you'll think you'll thank me for this in the future you will you will y'all like Dragon Ball Z right it's the same thing why was Goku so great cuz Goku was always bettering himself Vegeta is always bettering himself. That's why it's just those two are the strongest. Because they're constantly bettering themselves. Even if they got to be by themselves, they're going to better themselves. I, I guaranteed. They'll go, on, they'll go on like an isolated planet by themselves. Go to the hyperbolic time chamber to better themselves. Nope, you don't. No, make, make it so that way they need you. They got to need you. Not the other way around. Yo, I'm, I'm so nice in the game, bro. Because my friend helps me out with this whole girl stuff and makes me happier. Yeah, bro. So make sure you have a healthy balance between your friends and yourself. So even let's say if you aren't cool with your friends anymore, you still be right within yourself. So regardless of who's there, you know, family, friends, girls, whomever, you should always be fine by yourself or capable of being fine by yourself. If they put you on a deserted island, you'd be like, hey, cool. You know what I'm saying?